Hey guys, Andrew Reid here from Reid Performance Training. Been getting asked a lot of questions by the runners and the triathletes, particularly people in the MX12 VIP group, about a core exercise for running. Now, think to think about the core. Goal of the core is to keep your spine stable, to keep it in neutral position. So we want to prevent rotation, we want to prevent flexion of the lower back, that's what's called a neutral spine. And when you're running, basically if you're not controlled through your core, you've got this thing going on every time you run. So obviously that's fairly inefficient for running. We want to be able to lock it all together. We've got some other things going on when we run. So we've got this action where the hips are actually extending, this pullback kind of action that's creating our run. At the same time, we've got this cross body thing happening. So we need an exercise that gets us A, to lock everything together, B, that's got both action on this side and on this leg and gets me that pullback action. And the exercise we're going to use is the single leg deadlift. Now, the key about the single leg deadlift, it's a deadlift. So my single leg deadlift is here. My normal deadlift is here. So you see, the key here is not just that I bend over from the hips, that's no good because if I just bend from the hips, see my hips stay above my feet, everything's happening here in my lower back. What I want is that my hips get driven down and back. Imagine I was gonna go pick up a bar, this is how I'm gonna get to it. I'm gonna drive my hips down and back, keep my spine neutral the whole time. So I don't want any of this, I don't want this kind of thing going on. I need to lock myself together here. <coughs> the single leg deadlift, plant the foot on the ground, Reach back with the other leg. Hips go down and back the same way. Drive up to here. So my upper leg, excuse me, my upper leg is going to be in line with my body. Reach back with the heel. Drive up through the down leg. Now, we've got to lock the body together here. So I need a little bit of weight. I've only got a tiny little kettlebell. A dumbbell will work as well. You don't want a bar for this. It has to be a single implement. We're going to hold in the opposite there. So what I'm going to do, start my foot right next to the weight, reach my hips down the back, reach back with my other leg, grab hold the weight. Now, not loose, lock myself together, take all the slack out of my body, drive up through the hip, reach back, weight goes slowly down, drive up again, back down, breathe in, I breathe in, breathe out, sniff a bit, back in, and then stand back up. We don't want this thing, again, it's all happening in the back. This leg stays in line. Drive up through the hip. That's my running action. Take all the slack out of the body. The single leg deadlift will make you run faster. It will stop your back hurting. You may even increase some flexibility in your hamstrings while you're doing Get into it. A uh, couple of sets of five on each leg. Lightweight. Let me know how you go.